Hey everyone, Chinese New Year is two weeks away and I'm at Chinatown now to find some interesting things to draw like decorations that have been put up. Chinatown is always very busy but it's the busiest during Chinese New Year. We have people queuing up to buy roasted pork. This is one of the most popular brunch. Take a look at the queue. Stretches all the way to the back. So that's the last person in the queue. Those are actually the National Police Cadet Corps. It's an ECA in the school here. I used to belong to MPCC. This is the main street of Chinatown, right in front of the train station. This is a very touristy place. I think this is probably the most touristy place here in Singapore. Let's take a look at what they are selling before we get some sketching done. This is the year of the pig. So the Chinese zodiac has 12 animals and I belong to the rooster. This year is the pig. So we have a lot of soft toys. A lot of soft toys. A lot of children as well. The weather today is good for walking around but not that good for sketching because there's no light and shadow. I haven't been to Chinatown for quite a while so things have changed here quite a bit. Seems like they have all these temporary stores set up in front of the shop houses. These are actually pop-up stores that sell sweets. So every year we have a lot of pop-up stores selling sweets, soft toys, peanuts, basically Chinese New Year goodies, food, fruits, durian. <laughs> Looks like it might be quite difficult for me to find a place to sit and draw. These are dried meat. I want to find a place where I can sit and see the store, see all the people without being blocked all the time. Let me see if I can go up there. So I'm able to get up here, but this is a bit too high up. I need to go down one floor. And this is the view from the second floor. Still not ideal. That wasn't an ideal angle because most of the activity, the action is happening on the ground floor. I think I found a place to draw from. I'm going to draw this scene. I've brought along a panorama sketchbook today, so this is the scene that I'm going to draw. So these are the tools that I've brought with me today, the Sennelier 100% cotton accordion sketchbook. This is a customized fountain pen that takes zebra on it. This is the Sennelia watercolor box set that I'm going to use. This is the portable painter. I'll be using the palette here because this particular box, well, it's not good for mixing. This is going to be a very complicated sketch because I have a lot of pages to fill up. And 
I've only done one pitch. So I started from this line here. I want to draw this long line first so that I can get the proportion of the whole scene. So, uh, and while I was drawing, there's this lady who sat down here, which is great. I can use her to... Uh, I can make her as an anchor point here. And then I draw from left to right. My eye level is at the chest level, which is this level here. So all the chests of all these people, they will coincide with the eye level. So it makes it a bit easier to draw them. But because there are so many people uh, to draw, it's going to be quite tedious. And also notice that I have switched to a different fountain pen. That's because the earlier fountain pen that uses zebra on it, the ink flow wasn't that great on this paper. This paper is a bit rough. And because it's a bit rough, it's a bit dry, it needs, it needs pen with better ink flow. So I'm going to draw a bit loose so that I can draw a bit faster. So this is my completed panorama sketch of Chinatown. This is a very challenging sketch that took me around one and a half hours to two hours. I am not able to color this right now because the sun is going to set in 30 minutes time. So I have already taken some reference photo. I will color this at home when I'm free. There are so many people to draw, I mean, and they are always moving around. So the most challenging part of drawing this sketch is actually drawing all the people in the scene. That's the end of today's video. I wanted to come out here to Chinatown today because it's actually easier to make videos when I'm outdoors. I made two videos earlier in the morning and they weren't that good so I had to delete the files so that's why I came into Chinatown. Okay, so thanks for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. See you guys next time. Bye!